Hello there my beautiful Gemini. Welcome back to another video. My name is Lorena and welcome to Love Lorena. If you are new here, please like and subscribe. I would love to have you here with me and for you to receive monthly messages from your guardian angel, spirit guides, and the archangels. So let's get straight into your reading, Gemini. This is for July, sorry, not July, but August 2020. Let's do your reading for August 2020 and let's see what the angels want to tell you. So let's start off by burning sage. I always burn sage to clear out any negative energy and to bring loving thoughts into our environment to ask the archangels to ask our angels for their guidance now if you hear noise in the background i have my windows open i like to <laughs> i like to hear nature so you can hear the birds it's raining outside it's the evening time it's like 8 p.m Okay, so let's get straight into your reading. Archangels, guardian angels, spirit guides. What messages do you have for Gemini for August 2020? What does Gemini need to know to inspire, to motivate Gemini? What advice do you have for Gemini? Please provide three messages for Gemini. Three messages. Please. Okay. Gemini, we have three messages already. Quickly, quickly. We it usually takes a bit to receive three messages, but here we have three that came out. So let's go ahead and get into your reading, Gemini. Let's look at our first card. This is Compassion by Archangel Zadkiel. He says, soften your heart with respect to the situation and all the people involved, including yourself. So you might be heartbroken, Gemini. You might feel like you're let down by somebody, perhaps someone that you love deeply, and you don't really understand why this person has hard feelings for you, or you feel that this person is distancing themselves, or you feel like there is some sort of conflict that you don't know how to resolve. Now, Gemini, Archangel Zadkiel wants you to remember to see things with the eyes of compassion so that you can be at peace with yourself and not always torturing yourself in your mind about about what you should do okay so let's take a look let's look deeper into this message about compassion from archangel zadkiel so archangel zadkiel says i can help you forgive yourself and others or to compassionately see everyone's point of view you need not change your stance or behavior. It simply means approaching the situation with a loving heart, which empowers you and allows creative solutions to pour forth. So if you are having some sort of conflict with somebody, Gemini, it's time to open your heart and notice that only love is real and that all that fear that we have within ourselves is just holding ourselves back from being happy and truly attracting what we need to attract into our life okay so if you're attract if you're thinking about all that fear that you feel that is what you're attracting if you open your heart and just give love even if you feel like someone is not treating you well like you deserve then you will receive this love in return okay so thank you archangel zadkiel Let's take a look at our next message. Teaching and learning. Archangel Zadkiel again. Wow, this rarely happens. So Archangel Zadkiel is here with us. This is our second message by him. 
Keep an open mind and learn new ideas, Gemini. Then teach these ideas to others. So he's really trying to tell us to keep our hearts open and to see others with compassion. And this love that you feel in your heart is to be taught to others. This passion that you feel in your heart, it's necessary for you to show this example through your own life so that you can inspire others, Gemini. So let's see what else Archangel Zadkiel wants to tell you about teaching and learning. Archangel Zadkiel, thank you, thank you. Archangel Zadkiel, he says, you are a spiritual teacher and an avid learner. Learning and teaching are linked in a perfect cycle in which information comes to you when you need it. Teach others about the topics that awaken your passions. The more you teach, the more your lessons are reinforced within yourself. Be open to sharing new ideas and learning about topics that aren't in your immediate sphere of interest. Your students in your immediate sphere of interest, your students will teach you in many ways too. Trust in your teaching and learning abilities, Gemini, as your mind is one with the divine mind of God. You are an intelligent and wise being. Know that it's safe in this lifetime for you to be outspoken in your teachings. So this is what Archangel Zadkiel wants you to know. Listen to what your own intuition right now is telling you and receive the messages from the angels. Gemini, even if you're fearful, let go of this fear. Allow yourself to receive beautiful, loving energy from the universe. And even if you feel fear, go for your dreams. Go for what you've been wanting to do. You have this passion for a reason. You will help so many people, Gemini. So thank you so much, Archangel Zedkiel, for those two beautiful messages. Let's take a look at our last message. Archangel Azrael, comfort. I am with you in your time of need, helping your heart to heal. So again, you might be heartbroken, like I said, Gemini. It seems like you're really hurting inside. And the angels want you to know that they are here with you. You are not alone. So many times we think we're on our own doing everything on our own and we're tired and we can't find comfort. And Archangel Azrael wants you to know that you are never alone and there's so much love surrounding you that you just need to be open to receiving, to seeing this love within yourself. Start meditating, start focusing on yourself and growing that love within yourself, Gemini, so that you can heal. So let's take a look deeper into this card, Comfort. Archangel Azriel Gemini says, Even the strongest person experiences upsetting situations, and there's no shame in taking time to heal your heart. This is a good time for quiet reflection upon your true feelings. Write them down in a private journal and then call upon me to bring comfort to your heart and mind. I can help you sleep better at night and put your mind at ease. So if you are heartbroken, Gemini, believe in yourself that you will heal. And if this is your twin flame, if this is your soulmate, trust me, he will come back to you and, and or she will come back to you or you will reunite in a beautiful way if it's truly meant to be, okay? Everything is as, as it should be, as it's supposed to be right now, even if you don't understand it. It's for both of you to grow. It's for you and that other individual to grow and to see that only love is real. For you to learn compassion for each other and for all beings of this universe. You can help so many people by learning this yourself okay through yourself through your own experiences so 
These are our messages from Archangel Azrael and Archangel Zadkiel. We give a big thank you to our angels. I really hope you enjoyed this reading. And if you did, Gemini, please like and subscribe to see more of my cat, Moon, and Ginger. And to receive messages, these lovely messages from the angels. Thank you, Gemini.